News 13 at 5.30. The teen accused of killing an Albuquerque mailman on Monday will face federal charges. Xavier Zamora's federal case has been sealed because he is a juvenile. Meanwhile, News 13's Madeline Schmidt visited the neighborhood where Zamora was found last night. She's here with what neighbors had to say about the home he was hiding out in. Madeline? Jessica and Dean, the house Xavier Zamora was caught in is about five minutes from where Jose Pepe Hernandez was killed Monday. While interviewing neighbors, a woman pulled into the driveway and began yelling at us. Is there any way where you guys could give some privacy to the family here? Yeah, you, you, you need to give privacy. You guys do not know what happened, so get out. Can you tell us? Uh, no, I'm not going to tell you guys. That house is located on Whisper Point Street Southwest. We traced property records and tried multiple phone numbers for the listed owner. At one point, a woman answered our call, but quickly hung up when we asked for the owner by name. It's unclear if anyone will face charges for harboring a fugitive. A neighbor says he sees strange activity, including teens coming and going from the property all the time. I kind of suspected that those of us who are here suspected that something was eventually going to happen. And it did. In and it case. did. It was just a matter of time that something eventually was going to happen. This neighbor who asked to remain anonymous says he's always wondered where the parents are of the kids. He said law enforcement stormed that neighborhood last night and told neighbors to stay inside while they made the arrest. It is still unknown how police knew Zamora was there. Dean, back to you. All right, Madeline, thank you. The victim's family has created a memorial fund. You can donate at any New Mexico Wells Fargo branch. Just ask for the Jose Pepe Hernandez Memorial Fund.